Hi, this is Luke from Zeiss. I'm just going to talk you through some of our families of lenses and their applications. For the Sony cameras, we have three families of lenses, one of which is the Batis lenses. They are autofocus or manual focus. They have a display on the barrel of the lens here showing how far away the subject is and the depth of field. They are very, very light and yet strong, so useful for run gun applications, use with a drone or, or, or gimbal or something like that. At the moment, there are three focal lengths. There is an 18, a 25, and an AC5. The other family of lenses, very useful on the native Sony E-mount, would be the Loxia lenses. These are aimed at the world of video, so they have smooth, dampened manual focus and a de-clicked manual iris control. They are also weather sealed, um, much like the Batis lenses we started with. There are four focal lengths of Loxia now, a 21, a 35, a 50, and an 85. If you are using the Loxia or any other lens of ours for a video, we have also got this new product here, which is our Zeiss uh, lens gear. There are four sizes here, which between them fit all of our lenses. Incredibly easy to fit. You just slide the gear over the lens and then screw the thread here to tighten and that will lock in place, giving you standard 0.8 pitch gearing on your lens, like so. The other family of lenses we do for Sony fitting are the Tuit lenses, of which there are three focal lengths, 12, 32, and 50. The 50 is also a macro lens, a one-to-one -one macro lens. These are designed to cover an APS-C sensor or a Super 35 sensor. Uh, the 12 mil is about the widest, lightest thing you can put onto a Sony. In Canon EF mount and Nikon F mount, we also have a huge selection of lenses. The Milvus lineup has three new additions, which are a 15 millimeter, an 18 millimeter, and a 135 millimeter. These complement the existing set of six that we had. So now the entire range is, is quite full of all the usual focal lengths, including macros and short tellies and, and super wides. These lenses are incredibly well built. They're weather sealed at the rear, all the way through the chassis of the lens, built to take uh, dusty, damp environments and survive perfectly well. Optically, they're also extremely good. They match you know, quite demanding sensors, all the way up to red cameras, they work very well on. The next jump up in terms of quality in stills lenses are our Otis lenses, of which there are three, a 28, a 55, and an 85. These lenses are incredibly sharp, even at full aperture, which is 1.4 in all three cases, um, and can resolve astonishing levels of detail. Our classic cinema offerings would be the CP2s, of which we do 14 different focal lengths. Uh, these are made in Germany. They have an interchangeable mount system, so you can go EF, PL, uh, Micro Four Thirds, Sony E, Nikon F, and this is a user changeable system. All you need is a torque wrench, um, a set of shims which come with the mounts, to alter flange distance and possibly a test chart and the user can do it themselves. They have 114 degree threads on the front so they fit into standard box arrangements and standard 0.8 pitch gearing on the iris and on the focus for follow focus devices. They are colour matched and out of the box and have a nice long focus throw for smooth accurate focus pulling.